Yo, what's up everybody? Good night. We are here to play Hogwarts Legacy. Yes, very excited um, for this one. Been waiting on this one since they announced it. Hang on, let me move this back out of the way. It's it's loud, so That's I'm going to carefully just like slide this out of the way like that. It's it's our, our magical the bag of tricks. Criminal. Yeah, so here to play Hogwarts Legacy. Um, heard from Lupa, it was dope. He had a good time. Hearing from a lot of people that are having a good time. And I am ready myself for all the unforgivable curses. Give me all of them. I am going full villain mode. Do not expect any good things from me. I just want to be as evil as possible and have a good time while doing it. I don't know what that entails, but I guess we're going to find out. Wait, thanks for what? Oh, we got level two hype train. Let's go. Thank you. Got scared and thought that was Arby's. Nah, fam. We don't do that here. Uh uh. No more. Never again. Yeah. So, hope you guys are all having a fantastic night. Um, and hope you guys enjoy the stream with us and just chill Thank out. Thank you so much for the subs. Enjoy the vibes. Have a good time. All right. So, with that being said, we're going to let's jump in and see what we got. Let's get into this character customization. I heard it was pretty good. I, I heard it wasn't like over the top, but I heard that it was good enough for what it was. So, you guys are snapping see. with these subs right now. Get yeah, it going nuts. Thank you so much for all the love. <laughs> yeah, I solemnly swear I'm up to no good. Literally. Like off rip. Okay. You might have seizures. That's what this message is about. I'm good. Thanks for joining Adrian on YouTube. Thanks Manu for the reader. Donut, Uja. Off. Press L2 button to toggle. And. Okay, that's interesting. And we're doing good. Thank you. Thank you for the subs. Level 4 hype train. Let's go. Let's get it.
Thank you, one thing about me. High fidelity rendering favor and resolution. Oh, performance mode for sure. Thank you for the sub. Oh, what? Wait, have y'all heard anything about the, the high frame rate performance? Is that like, well, y'all watch this. They said balance does nice. So one person said balance does nice. I can switch it anytime. We're going to go with performance. If your monitor supports it. It does, but I mean, it's not going to affect y'all at all. Thanks for it? the gifted mem, Adrian. Alex, no. I just signed my life away. Or we can skip the sign in. I unlocked, unlocked the Onyx Hippogriff Mount. You may soar the Scottish skies on the back of this graceful black hippogriff. They said if you change it, you have to close the game. So oh, why? wow. Interesting. Yeah, wait, what? Oh, okay. Felix Felicis potion recipe allows me to brew liquid luck, which will grant the drinker a success in certain endeavors for one in game day. Oh, they got the, oh, the, the dark arts Kofi. Let's go. Garrison out with intricate details inspired by the dark side of the magic. Thank you for the gifted subs, Jimmy. Thank you so much. Level five hype train. Let's go. Oh, wow. Y'all maxed it out. Let's get it. Now we just got a bunch of gifted subs. Thank you so much for all the gifted subs. You guys loving on us tonight. Spoiling us Wait. tonight. Okay. Adjust the slider until the image is barely visible. What image? The black box? That's what I'm saying. On our screen, it's like... Yeah, I can't... I can see there it on go. Twitch's screen, but I can't see it on ours. There we go. That's good enough. That's crazy. <sighs> yes, Sonic. We are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as fifth year student. <laughs> I appreciate it, Mamba. Oh, we're in our fifth year. Interesting. Term begins on September 1st. Preliminary supplies have been collected for you and will accompany you on your journey to the castle. As you may be aware, the decree of, for the reasonable restriction of underage sorcery prohibits the use of magic by those under the age of 17 outside of school. Oh, sorry guys. I said I'm a bit too mush to the side. Oh. You, However, due to support. your unique circumstances, the ministry has graciously agreed to allow Professor Elizar Fig to help you hone your spell casting before escorting you from London to the castle for the start of term feast and the sorting ceremony. <sighs> Professor. Oh, let's go. Thank you for the gifted sub. All right, we have to find. If they don't have a good you, then we're going to be a good me. No, we. we... I can change the hairstyle and stuff on the character. No, I know. We just but have I'm to just find. If we can't find a good you. We're gonna be. We're we gonna have to find my face. I think the one that on the last row was more like your face. Where this? No. Um. You said the I last I row. I just saw it. It was on like the last row. That's the last row, ma'am. I know, and. I know you're not talking about this nigga right here. <laughs> no. Oh, uh, that's what I thought. So maybe it was the second to last row. The guy all the way to the left, maybe. The woman all the way to the, oh, that's to the a left. Woman. I can't tell in these small like images. They're ambiguous. No, hang on real quick. Hang on real quick, y'all. Can you move over? Sure. Even from your angle, that looks like a straight woman. Look from all the way over here. That you cannot tell. But you're not you. leaning back there. But look at that. Does not look like a straight woman. That looks like it could be a dude with a low mm. man bun. Oh, <laughs> wow. Listen, let's not go back to the nipples thing okay. now. Okay. <laughs> You're not going to use it as a shield forever, man. I am going to use it as a shield forever. Um. Yeah, see? Somebody said they, they resonate. They can see what, I, what I'm talking about. Well, y'all all need glasses. That's... I... Listen. My eyes can be trusted. I have LASIK. I have perfect vision. My eyes can be trusted. I can't say the same for any of y'all. My eyes can also be trusted. Okay. I'm going to rock with... I feel like this... I feel like that face... 
No. It's or this one. It's one of these two. Is or the it, bottom right corner. Shira, that's a white guy. What is the wrong one with that, you? You're you're light skin. Yes. He's not. He's brown. These are light skin niggas, bro. Or what about that one with the goatee? Like that one over there. Where? Not the goatee, but the dark sh that that one. The one over there. Right this? there. That one. The woman? Oh, that's another. For the second oh, time? Oh, my lord. They all look the same. Listen, the, it's the hairline. It's got to be the hairline. <laughs> oh, they said you can change the skin tone. So I guess if you can change. So oh, which what face? about this one? Right here. He has, like, your nose. Yeah. That okay. One. The dude with the extra, like defined jawline that i do not have okay but I'm i say you one. look more like that guy than this guy no i didn't even put the dreads on him yet See, somebody said that's actually close the other one the light skin one yeah i say that's that's more fitting of you what do you guys think this one i say this face bruh yeah they say that's more yeah, oh, they, okay. Yeah. I can adjust it. Oh, okay. Those are just stock. Okay, there we go. Let's. He has mad freckles, though. I feel like this looks like me. What about this one? Okay, what about this one? So, if you can adjust the face, go, go back to the other guy you're looking at, the dark one. Well, first of all, let's the do this. One? There we go. Wait, hang he on. He got too much freckles. We can remove that. Relax. Oh, okay. Let's stop worrying about the freckles. Okay, that's about me. Okay. Yeah, that's about your skin tone. All right. Oh, wait. Let me see. Yeah, that's about me. Okay. Face. That's not me. That's not me. Nope. No, not at all. Mm, kind of. And then now he's starting to look like the other guy you're gonna pick. <laughs> what about that one? Um, that one's actually kind of. That, that's you. that one actually kind of close, yeah. Oh, we already looking for it. Damn, I just wish that they could be like put back or something. You probably can. Not the cornrows. That's probably what it's got to be since they're they're like tied back. See, that's why I like to work Damn. from here down because then I can like I like to work from like the top going there. Down. Look, 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 gone. It's, it's gone. That looks absolutely nothing like you. <laughs> Yo! I'm just, we started at a good place and then like now it's just going downhill. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Well, all right. Let's. Oh, okay. Man. No. Can the, we go back to the original faces or is that going to wipe the whole thing? These clean? are all of the faces that are available. The only thing that they did was change the complexion and hairstyle on each of them. Oh. I see. Yes. So those were so stock. Those are included. Those in, are stock in, characters, and then this is making my own, basically. I understand. I say that's but. Oh, go back. The scar. Can I? I don't think you can get rid of the scar. Cause you have you have like a a more like straight nose. All right, well, listen, we just gonna have to pick. This is imaginary. That's why I said that one. That one's fine. It don't look like you, but we just not. It's, it's, we just it have to rock. What, what can we do about this hair? They color? said you can get rid of the scar. Okay, we haven't gotten that far yet. Dang. Thanks for the gifted mem, Zipor Castle.
Oh, right there. It's, Scars and somebody markings. said it's the forehead. <laughs> <laughs> well, I apologize. They don't have a, a big forehead option. Thanks for the dono yo yoinker of cheeks. Yo, he looks like Lil Dirk. He does look like Lil Dirk. <laughs> nah. What are you going to do my mans like that? Nah. I like the eyebrow thing. But if I'm a villain, right? If I'm going to be evil. that's why the evil, eyebrow thing was fine. If you're going to. That? Yeah. All right. Yeah. Let's just go. Oh, there we go. All right, you know what? I'm gonna have a little bit of fun with the eye color, cause it already don't look like me. I just want something. Just go with the brown. No, nah, I want something that looks like menacing or something, where people will look at me and be like, "Yo, like, he got something dark inside of him." I see, I see the brown eyes. Yes, they're to my ice cold. They said Roshi purple. All right, we can do that. Oh, eyebrow shape. Maybe this will I help think the, you. The, the purple makes him look soft. His face already looks soft. You don't even, you didn't want no scars. There well, we go. Well, then do the three. There we go. There we go. I like that. Or we can just do that. No. We're not doing whoopee. Alright. Oh, wait. Oh, voices? Wait. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. No. You didn't even let him finish. He doesn't sound sinister at all. I Well, I only have two options. So, let me hear it. Hang on. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. No, not at all. Let's hear that was quite something. Yeah. A few cobwebs yeah, and some definitely dust. Number two. Nothing to be concerned about. <laughs> Hang on, wait, wait, wait. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Oh, we can change the. It was the wonderful. Pitch. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this. Club. That was quite something. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Yeah, I like that. Okay. <laughs> what should I name him? How about we name him? Roshi Potter. No. <laughs> Stop. No. <laughs> they said yam yeah, lord. Yeah, Dwight. No. Give him my real name. That's so corny. How about like um Roshi McYamerson? What's sinister about that? Magic McMagic Man? I think that one's kind of fresh. How about... Roshi Rage? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I... Somebody gave me... Okay, I kind of like that. So we can take a play off of one of the character's actual names. I can name myself like Sirius Thanks Yamage. Thanks for the dono, Christopher. Dick Kick'em. Kick Dick Kick'em. <laughs> I got, where's the... into Harry Potter like that so you don't you, you don't know nothing about that yeah I really don't sir I'm gonna just call him sir <laughs> that's the first three digits um I can do like serious cakes serious Mc, Mc... fuck I'd name him Barry Serious buns. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Damn, that took forever. 
Because bun that. sounds like a lot. Serious thing. buns. That's I should have like did buns with a Z. That's all I could come up with. All right. They gave me my best shot. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. We've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand yes. wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me all the time. Oh, <laughs> Eleazar! George, That's how you pronounce it, Eleazar. That my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theatergoers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Mm -hmm. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. I'm going to take everything out beforehand. My apologies. Oh, she murders your ears. Just give me that. That was mine. No. Oh. Can you like name? Can you like name your? I told you. I said it's me. I pulled it away from the mic. Can you name your owl? And with that, can I name my my owl like some foul shit? Or do they block certain words? You don't get an owl? Wow! And yes, we're choosing violence today, Miguel. Wait, do I get to write? I caught you before you left for Scotland. <laughs> Just barely. <laughs> and who is your traveling companion? A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better so mentor. The game is loud. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Have you seen this? I have. They said now it's Opinions a bit low. differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues what of is the that? ministry, I believe he There's a is whole dragon a outside, bro. threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died. <laughs> Wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I... ...received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl. But with no correspondence, I can only assume... ...that she had to get rid of it quickly. To keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I, I should don't see blow a glow. Up. Oh boy. Nor do I. Hmm. We're actually part goblin. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? We did. <laughs> What happened 
damn, is he dead? Well, I mean, technically, that's, that would be the homies, right? Because we're villains. I want to be a villain. I want to ride with y'all. Hey, he's trying to, like, take us out right now. So oh, it's lit. Right now. Fuck the scroll, man. The key. Give me your heart. Oh, no. Also, dragon flashbacks. Thanks for the dono, John Kage. Stayed up in the London to see wipe your head to Hogwarts. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Appreciate it. Are you all right? You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. What happened? Poor George. Wow, I yeah. He... he got cooked. Yeah. What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage midair? A typical dragon would never be enchanted. Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. Mm. Oh, bro. I'm sorry, every time I see my name pop up on screen as serious buns, it's just... <laughs> <laughs> All right, I haven't unlocked the run feature yet. Typical video game stuff. Is there a run feature? Yeah. Oh. I'm not sorry. How far did that poor key take us? Farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. So, those ruins. Do you the think... The poor key was meant to lead us there. I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that poor key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, mm. I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Oh, you mean this path right here? There we go. Mind your step. <laughs> when you can the clothes be, be changed or? Can the what? The clothes be changed or? Well, yeah, I haven't even gotten to school yet. Why, well, damn. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes, a powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. The coat is the only thing nice about this fit. It's the shoes and socks so, killing it for me. Why was your wife searching for evidence What's wrong of with lost the fit? magic? The shoes Miriam and wanted socks. to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. <laughs> what really matters exactly is something. the one who wields it. And I will wield it for the dark side. Oh, it's a boss. This is straight Dark Souls door. Is that ice? 
It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that one work you were practicing. Meltus Itis. Focus Isis. on what? the center. I fucked the whole thing up. Meltus Isis. Hey. Hey. Oh, I heard you was talking shit. Oh, you like that? Thanks for the Donald D4 castle. Excellent. Have a nice time with this game. This is as far as I'll watch before I play it myself. Thank you for Thank stopping you in. and enjoy. Use your camera to select an active target. Some players prefer to select targets and move the avatar with the same stick. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Damn. I don't know you had to say something. <laughs> Grow up. <laughs> I like how he like oh, up there. It's so aggressive just Yeah, he swings that thing with conviction, man. Oh, oh, oh look at that. You trying to hide stuff from me already, game? <laughs> Your one works improving with every cast. Is Thank it you, sir. We're close now. It's just ahead. Listen, I'm trying to hit him. Steady yourself. Bridge. Repair Epic! The Grand Master. I hope there's like a giant evil creature back there. Almost there! Almost there. Yeah, this is like a straight up arena. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That portkey led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Hmm. Mini map shows your surroundings. I just have to toggle. Exactly, Post deadlights. Objectives. What? No, he said hello princess and the Professor, brochure. this statue. Exactly. This may have you didn't know what that was. <laughs> Wait, princess and the frog, what? What happened? What did I miss? When I said when I, when I said almost almost there the way I said it. Oh, yeah. I've never watched that movie. Yeah, because you're uncultured. We Professor, seen, like, most of the it's movies. a mural of some kind. Mm, perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. Thank you for the donut, Seraph. I don't know how to feel about this old man complimenting me on how I handle a rod in my hand. Very true. Thank you for the sub, Zagril. That's cool. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig. Whoa. <laughs> Sir? Oh. You like how he swings the stick? How odd. <laughs> Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again. 
Like the glow on the port key container. Well. Thank oh, you for thank the gift you for the memberships. Name. This shit says Godric's heart. A wall. This shit says wake the goblin, we? bro. I don't believe it. Is this? He's sleeping. Is this Gringotts? Bruh. Hello? Just a moment. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> uh, no <nowhere> here. <laughs> <clears throat> mm. Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding yeah. Bank. Vault number twelve, I presume. Huh? <laughs> Precisely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, yeah. Vault twelve. The key. Is that um? Mm -hmm. I don't trust it. He got dreads. Porky. Oh, <laughs> yes, of course. Okay, literally. This way, then. I did all the work. So whatever's in there, bro, I'm smoking you and I'm taking Stay it. Stay close. But you didn't see him build a whole bridge in front of you? You're like level one. He's like level 15. It, I can see the glow and he can't. That means I'm the chosen one. After you. Inside the cart, if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> well, look, sure, it's the ride from Universal. How yeah. many volts are there? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. Yeah. Take a breath. A what? Waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. That's actually pretty dope. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Yeah. Vault number twelve was commissioned shortly after Gringotts. It's like a gyroscope. Four centuries. The way it moves, like they stay the still, and then just the cart. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Bro, literally everybody's getting smoked. The two goblins. I mean, it would have to. There's no seat. seat Vault <laughs> number. You don't even look threatening, Vault bro. Twelve. Momentous What's day. His arm? <laughs> Yo, what is that? That looks like some magic shit. Yeah, his eyes. On your red. way. It like beefed him up. See, look. I got that look in my eye. Like, okay. Can we only see that? Damn, I do like a little dirt. This is crazy. Wow. Professor, hmm? the on band that God was wearing was glowing. Like the glow you saw on the oh, yeah, right, container. Yeah. Now I'm darker. I saw that same glow on the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. <clears throat> Bro, going to Gringotts is an all-day affair. It literally takes like three hours to get your fucking money. It's like, bro, I literally just want to withdraw $20. Here and you have to go are. through all of this to get to it. Obviously, they were drawing more than 20 bucks. <laughs> Listen. 
he's taking them to like bro i literally just, just need gas school. money and i gotta go on a whole adventure has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years in that time no one has visited vault 12. this place is very safe until today you trip and fell down there like that's it actually green gods is the most secure place in the world for money but not for people <laughs> Twelve. Thank you for your help. There's an actual person in there. Can I go in? Oh, okay. Well, damn, you're just gonna leave me out here, bro. What do you suppose we should be looking There's for? There's a whole nother I'm door. Not sure. I already saw it. Sir. I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Boy. Yeah, that wall is another door. I don't know if you saw it before we walked in here. No. I think it, like, uh, it activated before was it was supposed to. There it goes. Right there. Yeah. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio. Ravioli? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Okay, hang on. Let's see. Oh. You're making an arm. Rebellion. It's so funny because as a kid, as a kid, I didn't realize just how hilariously like basic the the Harry Potter spell words are. Reveal. Petrificus totalis. A door. Well, that's a star. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to. I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the portal right. container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret so of this why port. am I the chosen one, Lead bro? the way. Yeah, they said they're just Latin beings. Lumos! Yeah, Lumos. <clears throat> this is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I tell you. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. Yep. So might as well get a try. Your boy Roshika's Yamakata. What? Your boy Roshika's Yamakata. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Determine how to proceed. When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. Oh. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue. What statue? A, a, a statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Oh, Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. No. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Bro, nigga, turn hmm. around. Walk back Perhaps around. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Oh, uh, here we go. Okay, we got two spells. You've acquired the wand lighting charm Lumos, which has automatically been slotted into your spell set. Lumos, well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Gets up, proceeds to run my fade. <laughs> Yeah, they didn't stand a chance. He's 
not too much. I think we could take him. The teacher? Yeah. Yeah, now. He like turned them all into crumbs. We're just struggling with a couple. Oh, yeah! Where'd you come from? Stop that. Stay close. Now it's your turn, old man. No, he just died. He did not. Professor! Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? This isn't good. That's his soul, like in JoJo's, you see go? that? It's leaving his body. What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be... Ah, that's where they're leading. Lumos. Lumos, where are you? I'm on my own this time. Lumos. Oh. I have to wait for him to fully stand up. I didn't realize that. And Duma, no, they had to go at the same exact time. Oh. Bro, give me my shield, bro. Oh, okay, that's how the stupefy came out. Yeah, you get him blocked and I can't even see you, my Stupid guy. Almost just land on me. Something that crumbles. Lumos. All right, that's it, y'all. That's the platinum trophy for the game. It's been a fantastic run. Thank you for joining us for the stream.
give me my money? floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. Hmm. I wonder. What spell do you and Shira find most useful in real life? Avada Kedavra? I don't know. Shira's not into Harry Potter like that. In fact, at all. Follow my lead. I wouldn't say that. too well i wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow it will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as i can your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough percival we are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets with knowledge others will do anything to obtain yes and if we are correct charles the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. I've seen Harry Potter Federal. Oh, my memories. That's what you're seeing. The glow that it's surrounds ancient them. magic. Yes, sir. Astonishing. It's Can I see cream. magic. Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. So, I agree. Who were the bow tie that the I character has on looks fucking dumb. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. Bro, the armor! I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. No! <coughs> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. You're about to get hit. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist... You're about to get smoked! No! I was to grant access only to one with the key. And it's the... That was... I have no patience for traitors. Now... Where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. He's just mad they started the veneer procedure and couldn't finish it. Yeah, stop. <laughs> like, 
Oh! Wait, the protector? Yeah. Mink! Don't miss. That thing was getting cooked, man. Hush. Are you all right? Hush, Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where Bro, are we? The bow tie don't even make sense. It don't even match. <laughs> it can't be. You got on brown. It seems those who set up the pensive maroon, the locket, blue, and the path to both wanted someone with your the dad ability socks or the dress shoes <laughs> to end up here come we have a sorting ceremony to get to yes, let us get sorted that was a pretty dope intro Oh, okay, this game takes place a hundred years before the Harry Potter movies. Okay, good. Because I was literally gonna ask what the time period was. So now, okay, oh, once good. again, the clothes make. We haven't missed the sorting sense. ceremony. His trip is I'm nice. no expert, it's, but it's ours, that seems more. There you there go. go. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. I'm gonna Thank tell you. everybody. Ready for the sorting ceremony? So the hood, the hood we wear is pointy? What? No. It is pointy. It's not pointy. It's what? a triangle in the okay, back. Yes, you're right. <laughs> As all hoods are when you take your hoodie back. Mine you is never... round. <laughs> okay. If your if your hood is a circle when it's down, then it was not manufactured correctly. Phineas, Nigellus, <laughs> black. Is the hood pointy? <laughs> Prepare yourself to meet the, the headmaster. Fig. Nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Bro, complications. we got attacked. Tell them what it happened. Seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig. And I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. Thank you for the dono, if Javier. You're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this so evening. So you were on the way to school and then found out you're him, basically. That's what it seems. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Up oh, too bad when he gets back in touch, we're gonna be pure evil. See? Uh uh, ain't no way, bruh. <laughs> the hood isn't pointy, but that's it's, it's very pointy, it's sir. <laughs> Your hoodie does not look like that. Well, so don't play with me. You're just in time. <laughs> Have a seat. The hat's pointy, though, but that's a typical witch hat. All right, it's time. <laughs> ah, yes, a bit older than the others, aren't you? 
You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Oh, fuck school. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Hmm. I wonder. Hmm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Hmm. What is it? Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Thanks for the dono, Sarah. Mm, interesting. You recently <laughs> learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. Yes. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. Yes! Exactly where I wanted to be. I accept. Slytherin these yams. You belong in Slytherin! The hairline. <laughs> they have those straight razors back there. Oh, and one more thing. <clears throat> Due to the unfortunate injury Thanks on the some. pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Bruh. Huh? Enough. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. Uh. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. He said, get the fuck thanks out. Thanks for the sub, Hyper Gaming. I mean, thanks for the don't know Hyper Gaming. I was about to say if you get put in uh, a quite an close stream. <laughs> it's lovely to meet you. I'm Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student Ooh, to their comedy? Professor comment? Weasley. I shall see to it, sir. So are as you I the saying, great sister, grandmother? I'm Professor Weasley, pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. Probably as deputy right headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. Is it like a great great grandmother or great 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 grandmother? I mean, it's only hundred years, so it's, it's quite uncommon <laughs> for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin Yeah, great, common great. Room. Okay. Somebody said In order to enter, right one must simply Lately. speak the correct it's only hundred years. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. Hey. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Let the troll in the dungeon. Oh, uh, for anybody who was at Lu in Lupa's stream, what did he get put in? Lupa got put in Hufflepuff? Looks like everyone's gone. Bro. Better head to the common room. <laughs> they said they said he wanted Hufflepuff. What? Because it's loyalty. Okay. I wish this game was like online and I could just go find his character and just smoke the shit out of him. Was that a Gryffindor? It. Yeah, he was Gryffindor.
Find your common room. They said he got Slytherin first and then chose Hufflepuff. Oh. Ew. I suppose some introductions are in order. That is not helpful. Hello, commoner. I am your new master. Can I help you? Bow before me. Ah, oh, you're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Sallow. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs, who merely joined us for the ride. Still, impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. It was dreadful, certainly, but quite an experience nonetheless. Interesting perspective. How did you and Fig manage to escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. Or not. So, quick question. Just so I can see how much detail they really put into the game. When you get sorted into different houses, are the characters in each house different or do or did they just make like the different personalities stock characters so like if i was in gryffindor sebastian they would be in yes, gryffindor different. oh okay that's cool what book were you reading a spell book i picked up has a few interesting things but not exactly what i was looking and for what were you i'm looking sure for? you'll find out soon enough but not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks ah i fuck with you are you saying some spells aren't taught at Hogwarts? Which ones? Unforgivable. Seems I may have met a kindred Facts. spirit. <laughs> that is a conversation for another Thanks time. For the dono, Sarah. It was good meeting you. Good luck today. No one is going to convince me that Slytherin wasn't founded just so that the wizarding world won't get boring without villains to fight. Literally every villain is from that house. My thing is, it's like. So why is it that when kids get sorted into Slytherin, why don't they just like kill them immediately? Like when the hat's like, okay, Slytherin, because like it's inhumane. just immediately murk them like right then and there to just quell any kind of rebellion of any sort. Because it's inhumane. Damn, I'm just going to aggressively. They eat said them. Merlin was a Slytherin. I guess y'all have a point, but basically, like, like, all the, a lot of fuckery goes down in Slytherin, you know what I'm saying? They said Slytherins weren't bad until Voldemort. They said, if you're in Gryffindor, your friend is Sarah Spitout. Very interesting name. <laughs> That's a lie. Y'all lying. <laughs> I think I heard one. Is it better than Seth Swallow? <laughs> Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Ah, he's based blind. Based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm Ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Wow, that's well, interesting. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. A blind character and it's... I'm not no pussy. I like to make an well, entrance, bro. If I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> You're definitely in the right house. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here, though I doubt you'll need it. Were you expecting to be sorted into Slytherin? <clears throat> Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Not something I'm especially proud of, mind you. He was obsessed with blood status, a pure blood maniac. Unfortunately, most of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. What was that? They said, Nightmare Eclipse Gaming, thanks for the dono. 100% not true about Slytherin House. Ma Effas must not know that Harry was originally sorted to Slytherin and he declined. His son was sorted into Slytherin. 
Oh wait, Harry Potter's son was sort of in this. That's interesting. I didn't know his son. I didn't know. I don't know much after, son. but I remember because the sorting hat knew that he was a parcel tongue. But I knew that it wanted to put Harry into Slytherin, but he was like, no, yeah. Gryffindor. Thank you for the Peter sub. Pettigrew was I mean, the Gryffindor and betrayed everyone for Voldy, so not just Slytherins are evil. Wasn't Peter Pettigrew also a, a literal rat? Like, that that's also suspect. So they should have smoked him too, bro. Like, you could you could turn into a what, bro? A rat? No. Did that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. Thank you, Ominous. Very nice to meet you. You Pleasure can turn into Gunna. Don't be a stranger. <laughs> what? Stop. Stop. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, might want to think that again. I thought she was singing. I did too. <laughs> I was like, whoa. Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Checkmate. Told you. <laughs> the head shape. You should have listened to me. Ah, oh, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day, taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills in a broom are legendary. Damn. She know how to ride a broomstick. Yeah, we know how to slang one. <laughs> we handle it. <laughs> and I think you're underestimating the nature of a dragon. A broom would have been kindling. <laughs> <laughs> Not the way I fly. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Damn. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. This conversation is a whole sexual in your though. You fly you a, lot? a lot of time to fly during school. I make the time. There's nothing like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Okay, I got you. Are you a keen wizard chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the match. Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. Also, it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so obvious. Why does no one else see it? Goodbye, Amelda. Nice meeting you. <laughs> the is the new fifth year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. Serious buns running around like, where are all the other black students? <laughs> Am I the only one in Slytherin? My God. They said she rides a broom with nothing under the skirt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so she could catch a splinter. <laughs> oh, hello, my fellow black. I'm serious. Why can't I speak to you? Oh, okay. So we we. Thanks for the gifted sub. Uh, okay, we kind of deep. That's, just, that's yeah. an interesting one. Rub the ball. Spin it round and round. All right, I guess that's it for people I could talk to in here. I wasn't paying attention. That scared the shit out of me. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts. I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. 
After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. There's a guy for sucking. Here you are. Yeah. <laughs> a book full of evil spells. Are those mechanical parts? Oh. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. A grimoire. Listen, she said you only have one first day Thank at Hogwarts you, unless what you're you Hermione Granger with that yeah, damn device she had. Learn. Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. Thanks for this. This way. Sub arrow. Move, bitch. Sorry. What is that? A guide to cotton? <laughs> I certainly yes. would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was. I cannot. Listen, man. I can't. <laughs> Listen, bro. Listen, given the given would, the time it period, would, it would explain the hoods. <laughs> yeah, a guide to cotton. That's sick, bro. It's Black History Month, man. You can't be saying stuff like that. <laughs> Thanks for the don't know uncertified haters. L, she's 15. For first, the Thor daughter debacle. Now this FBI you're about to have a field day with you. But we didn't say Actually, she was attractive. Thor's daughter did not was not designed to look like a fifteen year old, bro. But nobody was saying that girl was attractive. Was no, they were just saying because we were just making nasty jokes. Wizarding lore. But they pretend like fifteen year olds Do don't this? nobody. <laughs> Some fifteen year olds. Why don't you cast are like that. on that statue Ooh. and see Wait, what details no. the field guide can sure. provide? <laughs> Wait, I think I can wait. Yeah, you just gonna look at me, bro? Revelio. Oh. The statue depicts the Kelpie, a shape shifting water demon native to Ireland and Great Britain, which usually takes the form of a long maned horse. The largest Kelpie ever reported is the Loch Ness Monster in Scotland. Field guide challenges are the only way to acquire experience points or XP. Sweet. <laughs> Wizarding level. Thanks for the gifted subs, Larry. Thank you so much. Collecting your first guide page unlocked a new challenge category new challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here each challenge is tier special rewards unlock at each tier you complete from appearances to critical upgrades the rewards must be claimed from the challenges menu Ooh. clever isn't it Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that inside and outside of the castle. Where are you taking me, ma'am? timing sir perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker Ooh, fast your travel. field guide contains a map of the castle open it up and find central hall diagon alley I said find central hall
Select the Grand Staircase region to continue. Okay. So each region has multiple flu flames. Okay. I like big ass castle. And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. Damn. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. But what if I am A mastery the of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. What will I learn in Charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. Bless He's you. a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. That's what I want to know. You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer mm -hmm. there with friends in due course. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least Thanks, showing you the basics. Bro, she don't got no professor. She don't got no lenses on her glasses. As to the events preceding Oh wait, yes she, does. yes she does. Specifically They're barely about there. What happened after okay, that I was like Is she serious? My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Thanks for the dono, Sarah. I'm sorry, Defense Professor, but I'm afraid arts. that's all there is to it. Almost every single of its hmm. professor was either dead Almost or monster Almost precisely what crazy. Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic it seems hmm well i'm just glad you both arrived in one piece perfectly good boats and carriages to hogwarts and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon i wouldn't say i chose the dragon's path professor rather unfortunately it would seem that it chose us very well enough chit chat i need to get to class myself might i rely on you professor fig to explain the details of the field guide's map of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. Bro, this kid in the and back has been practicing this fucking spell for like... Because I'll be using it to keep up to Just date hang it up, bro. Yes, Professor. Practice Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today. And I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. You gonna turn on the AC? Sure is over here freezing, like yeah, about like to negative twenty degrees. About to breathe ice next to me. Yeah, are they flirting? Is there? As somebody was asking if they were, um, <laughs> if Professor Weasley was flirting with us. Thank <laughs> you. 
Bro, the minute they let me attack other students is over. Hey, you have a crazy time. I wonder why I'm so cold. I'd wager the Hufflepuff common room's the coziest of them all. Simply the fact that it's so close to the Careful, that kid's a Hufflepuff. He has nothing to lose. <laughs> <laughs> almost always leave the door to the right okay. All right, let's go, bro. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you masterfully evade Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival? I did my best, but I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well trained. It's time to take Happily, class. You have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not so subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guides map? Unfold it and have a look. Okay. It's main quest. Completing main quest will further the story. Unlock new features and grant XP. Some quests unlock my spell and or level requirements. In these cases, you will need to be the required level and or have the required spell to activate the quest. Drop the quest with X to continue. Oh, so we get the Levioso spell as a reward for that and Asio for the charms class. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead. What with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. See? You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. Yeah, He's an exceptional craftsman yep. and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Thank you for the dono, Sarah. So, so go ahead. So the Weasleys really went from esteemed professors at Hogwarts to bums living on a farm in the middle of nowhere. Literal riches to rags. It's fucked up. Did you say it like that? I have a question. Does anybody? Hey, bro. Hey. Hey. Hey, yo. What is wrong with you? I want that. Isn't that your map? Yeah, you're literally taking the damage. I can't catch you, bitch. What's up? Huh. Where'd it go? Right there. <clears throat> yeah, bitch. I think I need the the Asio spell to get that. All right, I got you. you. Okay, you got it. Um. So, does anybody know if the Sectum Sempra spell is in here? The Sectum what? Listen, you don't understand. Sectum Simple. Is the Sectum Sempra spell in this game? Nah, it wasn't invented. No. Listen, that is my favorite part of any Harry Potter book Just ever in all of the books. When he split Malfoy's shit open in the bathroom and the way it was described. Oh, that. He was like, ble and then they didn't even do it justice in the movie. He was leaking, bleeding all over the bathroom. I'm like, this is gangster. Oh, they said gangster. Snape invented that. So oh, that's Snape. what it was. Okay. Damn. Hello. I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenora. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. 
Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. <laughs> Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. Ooh, good hint. Are there any other empty paintings like this around the school? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. If I can work a out the riddle, riddle of this one, uh, I'll know uh, what to do uh, with uh, all of uh, them. Uh, uh, as good a place uh, uh, as any to begin. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Lumos. Do come and find me if you stumble on that spot. Must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Hey. Yeah. I tried a new one. Okay. Staircase to the left. Yeah, you're talking about muggles and shit, bro. Relax, bro. Oh, there this we looks go. like the location from the painting. What could be so special about it? Aha. Statue of Gregory the Smarmy. This statue with an in great ingratiating grin depicts the medieval wizard Gregory the Smarmy, the wizard famous for inventing Gregory's unctuous unction, a potion that makes the drinker believe whoever gave them the potion is their best friend. Yeah, he's my unctuous give that, unction. Give that to my daughter. She'll always be my best friend forever. I have a potion idea that I you can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before that scared I invented the shit out of me. That's a that's dope. Yeah, I just yeah, I just gonna stop talking. Mm -hmm. Okay. That was it. Half a bottle of flabbergasted leech. Oh, she said the F word. And that, that's what I thought too. That's why I was like, what? My for uh, I need that spell. I found the location depicted in the painting. What is you even talking about, cuz? All right, whatever. Thanks for the dono, Grim Reaper. What are your thoughts on the game so far? I think it's uh, pretty cool so I far. I think it's pretty cool. It's very detailed. I have no complaints. I need that butterfly to stick it right there. How do I grab that? Do I need the... The ASIO spell? Oh, wait, what was this? Oh, is this all for this door? Alright, this is like a weird ass puzzle. They wasn't joking, this whole place is a riddle. Uh, yeah, I think numbers and uh, sure. I'm looking at this and I'm literally like, huh? I've got the chemistry meme going on in my head right now. 21, 11, and then there. All right, I'm out, bro. Can't you just play around with the, the different um circles there? Yeah, but it's not going to rearrange all that. Can I touch the things on the side? Nope. All right, we go into class. That's what we're doing. I thought I was already tracking. 
Actually, oh, there it is up there. Well, that it's, matches the thing that was It's probably there. not hard to figure out. I cuz these two Yo, thank you for the donut wolvesy. Would you like some help solving the mirror riddle? Uh no, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. You already have the spell you need for the moth. Okay. And thank you for the donut, Josh. Lumos. Oh. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. That's all it takes. It was that simple. Ha! I knew there was a connection. I should tell the Nora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Connection, connection. What's your affection? Where'd she go? Oh wow! It disappeared, and then Lenora is gone. That's that's fucking awesome. She's a butterfly. Oh, I never feel fear. She's a beautiful right. butterfly. Ah, uh, what was I doing? Ah, this riddle. So we, these two, are animals. What is that up there? Is the first question. It looks like an upside down bird. It's exactly. like a dragon head. Yeah. Yeah, it's like a dragon. Is it counting the legs on these creatures? I think so. Something to equal One, 21. 2, 3, 4, 5. That could be way off base here. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. That equals 11. Wait, what equals Whatever 11? Whatever that, those are. That uh, equals, that's 11 of those. That's 11? Mm-hmm. One, two, three, four, five. So that's at sixteen. So a a unicorn? I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I'm. I'm gonna try it. And then this one is 21. Thanks for the dono, the Sandwich King. I just tried different combos until it works because it didn't make any sense. <laughs> no, that's already up there. What on here has four limbs? That salamander up there to the right. No, not okay. I see it. I see something huh. that. Okay. All right, that that thing that I was looking at is just not on here. So I'm gonna try that. All right, and with that, we go to class. I like that there's like riddles and stuff all over the the castle though. Mm -hmm. This is a pretty big sandbox. I'm not even going to lie. I'm allergic. Yeah. Now but for wait, one for real pussy cat. Oh, does that does that not do anything? Do I not get anything for that? 
You got experience points. That's funny. Whoa, that was an aggressive letter from home. Yeah. That young'un's now a teacher herself. It's a wonder she's not gobbled up by her own fanged geranium. <laughs> nah, there's a lot going on in this place. This painting depicts the young orphan wizard Ilias, who famously saved his entire village from an army of dementors and the dark wizard. Raxidian by conjuring a mouse Patronus. That's there's a lot going on in this game. That's very dope to me. Mm-hmm. Like a real school. Like a lot yeah. going on during school. Like I feel like it would take me at least a hundred hours to go through everything. Oh, this is it, class. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. It's a tape party. For no reason. Hello what the fuck? Oh, it's ghosts. Yeah, it's a ghost. Can you face through me? That's crazy. They they like just got s what the fuck? Oh, what is that? That looks sinister. All right, let's go to class. Okay, so you can eat and drink everything. That's a nice touch. Mm -hmm, it's very detailed. All right. Down to the stained glass windows. Is that all you've got? He's gonna use one of them spells he's not supposed Let to use. Professor Hackett! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces in your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. Skills. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will She's review a spell give you that has saved the, 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 the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. She's a don't estimate a bit back. A levitation okay. Thank you for the Oh yeah, shut up. A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One she thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Levioso. Now, let's try something a little larger. These years. Yeah. That's right. Move all that shit. I'm him. I will lift anything in here. I don't know who she thinks she's dealing with, Shira. 
I will fold this old lady she right now. Let us begin with a basic cast. What the? See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent. As Master Pruitt so artfully helped me demonstrate earlier. Levioso. Good. Now, well done. Oh. Levioso. The best way to practice is by dueling. Oh, I'm about to murder this kid. With you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel. You notice the basic cast. Yeah, that's and what they're making fun of it. Oh. You may begin. Right, what's that? <laughs> I know. Protego. Lucky. Nothing lucky about it. Stupid Protego. Levioso. Hey, this can't be your plan. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. <laughs> Not too bad a for a beginner. You give as good as you get. I put you on the spot to fuck and me, you rose to the challenge. What's up? Points Maybe. to Slytherin. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. It's actually kind of serious. Hey, why are you so close, bro? Oh. My fellow. What is... What the fuck is going on? Why are they converging on me? Y'all good, bro? Bro, bro, I'm stuck, bro, <laughs> bro. They said Luba. <laughs> I can't move. I literally cannot move, bro. Bro, let. Damn, man. That was crazy. Oh God. All right. What is your problem? Oh. I'm not much for dueling. I prefer to keep things friendly. Much prefer to keep things friendly. Arthur Plumley, and that's how he sounds. You dueled Sebastian. He's strong competition. Well done. You're not even looking at me. I'd hate to face Professor Hecate in a duel. Oh, Imelda. Hey, I I figured I I figured out your riddle. Wait, was she the one with the riddle? No, she was the one that what was smart. What is she looking at? She was the one that was smart with the chess. She okay. Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first years. Not anymore. Lumos. Revelio. If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you, not the other way around. Nice work. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be Swallow talking about buttons. it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? <laughs> we fit right in. Felt more like I was dueling an expert. 
didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. That's right. <laughs> Fair enough. You owe me an honest duel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. He lures us into a dungeon. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Wizard Fight Count Club. Me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. Like, yeah, if sure you, you want to get the most right. out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Nah, Look for Luke and Brattleby well. near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Hey, Till yeah. next time. Charms class. Oh, is it tracked already? Oh, yeah. I didn't even notice. Wait, am I supposed to go up? Yep. And then I'm gonna go back down and get that page. Oh, look, another cat. Look at this, all over the place. Where'd you see that? What the? Where'd the second cat come from? He just came. Where'd you see that I got experience from that the first time? I didn't get no yet yeah, no XP from that. I didn't remember okay. seeing XP from that the first time either. No, but when I pet it, you said you got experience, and I was like, I thought I was like, oh, I must have missed it. No, I meant you got experience touching. Cats. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Wasting my time. I would have never pet that thing. I thought I missed it. No. I'm done listening to you. Professor Ronan tends to go on a bit. Wow. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Quite badly. Some of us oh. don't necessarily want him to get back to the lesson. <laughs> you got experience touching cat. <laughs> okay. Enough. <laughs> You're shut down. Wow. You're shut down. Here. Behind you. There is an open seat here. Oh, that's what? dope. Hello, I am Nettie. That's so I you know. are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of Chant. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold of personality with a on him and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right? Now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Quick, you set me up. Mm. Well, that's your book. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing Obliviate on one another. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, hmm. oh, Nobody's you laughing, even remember bro. remember how to perform a basic summoning charm. Hmm? Hmm. Well... It seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Oh, here we go. Nude. 
The gimme that spell. Akio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. I was about to say, class done already? So, like... Nothing. <laughs> nothing. Ah. I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> Fishing. Oh, that's cool. It's a whole game. <laughs> so why don't we have our newest student start us off? Hmm? Huh? <laughs> they told me to speak my truth. Because <laughs> they probably already knew what I was going to say. Very simply, cast Akio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Now, uh, think not to worry. Right. All I was gonna say on, is I wait. think I think they did a really good job diver diversifying the hair textures. I just think like some of the styles, you know, they could they could have tweaked a little bit more. That's all. Very good. No. Stay focused, man. If you don't. Sh Very good. Points to Slytherin. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. Well, listen, I'll say what I'll say one thing. This shit better than Elden Ring. Oh, yeah, for they sure. They didn't have no black hair. The only thing they had was like a ball, fade, a ball fade Clear? or a boosie fade. Yes, I'm saying like the, the dreads are nice. The girl with the headband, fine. The, the African one we were just talking to, like... What's this? Like, you know, we could have been a little bit more creative there, just just slightly. Oh, so yours like a it's like a creativity thing for you. Yes. Yes. Alright, come on, let's go. Akio. No! Okay. You finna get Excellent smoked, man. Let's go. Alright, place your bets. Place your bets. All right, sure. What do you think? What do you think? Very you think good. I can hit the 50 again? Mm -hmm. Whether you think you can or cannot, it's entirely up to you. You're both right. Both answers are right. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Oh. Wait. Wait, it fell? Thanks for the sub. I know everyone is watching, but try not to be nervous. You are doing quite well. <laughs> they said you can hit her ball off. Is that what she just did? Not is that what you just did? Lesson, is it? Not that I mind. Okay, I got some for you. Akio. They said no, it fell because of you. <laughs> Nicely done. Oh. She won. She beat you. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Can I rematch? 
said you'd have to reload your save. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. All right. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. I'm also playing a hard difficulty, so. It so it probably has Here an effect go. on how she operates. Yes. Stupid. I mean, it's still that pretty dang far. Start going easy on you now, ma'am. Listen, you're laughing, you gotta do better. Oh, well done. <sighs> come on, come on, hit that shit. Nope, she's good, he's in the clear. Whew. All right, we getting petty now. Nope. I know everyone is watching. Akio. Try not to be nervous. You are doing quite well. Yeah! Yep, she just got more points because of you. No, she didn't. It was at 50 already. No, it was at 30. Let us see this. It was literally on oh, okay. the 50. It was at 50. Okay. No, it was at 30. Yeah, I was right. It was at 30. You gave her more points. You Bro. pushed her ball to the next color block. She's cheating. All right, all right. We finna tie. Cause... Not exactly your typical lesson. Is Shut it? up. Not that I mind. Akio. Yeah. Oh, you're not gonna tie. We did tie. I just knocked her shit off. Yeah. What's up? What's up? But tying is not winning. What's up? Yeah, but I'm not gonna let her get the drop on so me twice. Good, both one of you. Well done. What do you think this is, man? But she technically won because she won the first round. It doesn't count. It does. That count. was a warm up round. Is there an achievement for beating her? Class is dismissed. Gather Serious your buns. <laughs> it's really buns. A tight game. It turns out we were evenly matched. See, we were evenly Did matched. To become proficient with Akio. It took you weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Thanks for the dono, Seraph. Thank you, but I've been holding my own. I appreciate your confidence. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before oh, I knew it, so we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world <laughs> at a new school <laughs> in a new petty. country. <laughs> oh. Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me. That's cool. This enormous school. I would actually like to see that. In this may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. What? Wakanda forever! You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. That's what? Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. Bro, they're mutants. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. Yeah, but it's much they better. They said Voldemort can't even do that. Right? Whoa, they dangerous over there, bro. Hey, you, bro, my character needs a retwist. 
Yeah. Listen, I said he that. He kind of, he kind of. I said a, he ain't got no edge. He kind of needs a retwist like me, but his edge is kind of pixelating in and out, so it's it there. But when they zoomed nice in, they were literally who cares? <laughs> Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Of course, you can use Akio on humans if you're so. I am well, so inclined. You'd be using it on a word if you would. I think is that Harry Potter? Bro, it's you. Bro, wait. Talk, bro, wait. Professor Ronan reminds me of my grandfather. Loads of wisdom, but a bit mad. The boy who lived. Oh my god, I can't believe it's really you. From the future. Is there something? Is there like a chest in here? No? You wanted to speak with me, Professor. I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? And what a close match between you and Miss Onai. Invigorating. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, <laughs> Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside Ooh, of the ordinary got a bonus? curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon oh, okay. regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. That's cool. Complete main quest one of four. You're the new student, aren't you? It's not me. No. <laughs> Does me do the same thing? No. Hello. You wanted to speak to me? Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. What are they saying about me? Hope your first day is going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. Thank you, but it really wasn't all that challenging. My brother will. I'm literally gonna be a dick about so everything. Humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be a bit overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I find Professor Ronan's lessons a bit more challenging than you do. Yeah, I'm an asshole. Don't talk to me. Too easy. Ah, oh, okay, I can track that quest. But first, let's go to the map. To the map. To the map. To the map. This is huge. Yeah. Where's the? Thanks for the dono, the damage king. Those games are hard as hell. Don't worry, I didn't realize you can knock the opponent's balls over until I did it the last second and gave her fifty points. And <laughs> gave her fifty points. Um, where? You they know said what? you have dope skins for your clothes if you have deluxe edition. Can I? Uh, oh, yeah. Can I update that stuff? Oh, gear. Let's go. I forgot. No. What? Why? Why can't I change it yet? I'm pretty sure I have. They won't let me change. They won't let me change it. Yeah, you have one. Wow. No. Yeah, let's walk around in our jammies, in our underwear. Did I just turn off all my clothes on accident? They said press square for change appearance. Oh. Yes. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Mm. 
I mean, at least it covers up most of like the clothes underneath. <laughs> Dracula. <laughs> Lord of the Dark Arts. Lord, suck your blood. Yeah, the OJ gloves. What else we got? Well, I don't know if I don't know if I'm trying to have on the Dark Arts Kufi though. Mm -mm. Hang on, wait. No, because I have this one. No. Nah. Even bigger, no. Nah, I like a whole What's pirate. What's the other one next to it? Take that off, G. Ah, yes. It is I. Nigga Voldy Gold. Yeah, thanks for the donut joking, Nessie. Imagine being able to launch magical Nair. You know, I don't know why I thought they would let me do that. Yeah. Alright, we finna break the game real quick. Hang on. Nope. They literally just won't let me do it. They said you can put your hood on by pressing triangle. Protego. That's what somebody said. Bro, okay, where where was that other area, dog? Where? They said in the menu. Oh, okay. Hang on. I'm trying to do my fast travel stuff and I'm I'm failing. Okay. Triangle while hovering over cloak is hood. Okay. There we go. Where is it? At least this hood is less pointy. Yeah, now it's gone. Oh. Bitch. Why gotta be all that? Because I came here specifically to shut that down. Ooh, that's dope. I'm a beautiful that's butterfly. Oh wow, that, that's moving up there too. Yeah. The dragon, that's cool. Okay. The unicorn and the... Um, that's what I wanted to do. Well, first of all, okay, that's untracked. I want to go check out this fight club. It's yes gear. Mm -hmm. The bard. I'm actually having a, a lot more fun than I expected. Yeah, it's a lot the world is very like rich. So far. The run. Does he have one boots now? Um, yeah. I'm not sure. Hey, Lumos. Is it nearby? Is that nearby? <clears throat> There's a painting. What is that of? I don't know. Is that a horse? It's like a horse. 
What are you up to now? Mind your tongue. I really don't want to get sidetracked. I, I really want to go to this mission real quick. I can see that this is going to be a problem. I'm going to get sidetracked a lot. Talk to Lucan Brattleberry. Or Brattleby. Whoops. Reading's hard. That scared the oh, shit out of me, yes, bro. Me too. Oh, not I'm again. Like, Here I've come from yeah. the toilet bowl where she Willy said Wonka. I could swim. Did you practice your mole? As long yeah, as we're only one you're time wet with week, toilet I can plunge the boy's lavatory. Not for the meek. Yep. These peas will make me late. He tried to stop me, did rancorous carp. Sought to trap me, confine me inside of a jar. But he failed us, did his containment you fling in doodle so water? So what is wrong with you? And, and he stinks. It was granted my privileges, be handsome indeed. Or I'd fire up the cannon, and so she agreed. To draw yeah, you drop your book again? Sure, not with him, that if I behaved, I'd have one weekly swim. Whee! Okay, you finish. Nigga, you just gonna leave your books? Yeah? Oh. Rebellion. Haunted toilets. Unless in dire straits, it's probably best to avoid this particular toilet as it is allegedly one of Peeves' favorite pranking spots. So why don't they make him leave? <laughs> you guys have magic. Why you could they easily him? get rid of him, but sure instead you let him stay there and blunder the toilet. Because sure, it's part of the ambiance. No, it's not. So then don't get mad when I'm late at class because your little thing was flinging doo-doo water at me when I was walking my books. <laughs> what the fuck is going on in this place, man? Ah, if I could undo all that happened that day, I would. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Ah. Interesting. That's something I can interact with. That prank that is not harmless. It. it is spread E. coli. Just over there. What's this? Or pink eye. Or just doo doo in general. Which is bacteria. Akio. Rebellion. What is this for? Levioso. There you go. Yeah, that shit just vanished. Off on another adventure, are we? Mind your business. Oh. Weird. Weird flex, okay. Oh, you. Can I help you? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinated duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. I seem to have a knack for dueling. Then you've come to the right place. How does cross ones work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? I'm ready for the smoke. Of course, dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in crossed ones, you can duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Get me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! I'm about to cook somebody. 
Somebody boots about to get smoked. Okay, yeah, he's we'll done. We'll make you regret signing up. Yes. Okay. Don't count me out yet. Brilliant. Listen, y'all not y'all not gonna y'all not gonna punk me like that, bro. Help me, bro. Oh, there goes my way. What is this nigga Sebastian that doing, bro? Painful. What is he doing? Can't you try another Help one? me, bro. Yes, don't count me out yet. <laughs> he jump by six year olds. <laughs> bro, this guy's not doing anything. Thank you. Cook them, bro. Nah, we getting you up out of here, bro. We getting you, we getting you up out of here. You're done. You're done. You're done. Yeah, you're next. What's up? Bitch. You suck. Don't ever pair me up with this guy. Nice they work. You suck. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. <laughs> There's strong competition they ahead, you never but block or keep parry. this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first crossed ones victory. Well fought. Hope to see you back here again. They said he's actually was doing fine. You were the one that was sucking. He was doing fine. He was standing right here and not moving, bro. Because they said he was casting longer spells. Well, I don't need that. <laughs> God. They said he did his job. <laughs> okay. You were the one that sucks. Okay, y'all capping for this guy right now, bro. A captain for some AI. That's. I see y'all. He said you should be using Protego like Batman and Arthur. Protego! Well, when I did do it, old girl turned around and he wasn't dealing with her. And then she hit me with Leviosa. That's what happened. Because. She would shift focus to me when I was smacking up her friend, and then Sebastian's just there, like, not doing anything. You bum, where is he? So I can tell him to his face. Next time you need a partner for Cross Swans, don't hesitate to call on me. Bitch. Till I've grown a bit, then we'll see how well you do. I feel sorry for your next opponent. Feel sorry for your mother. All right. What do we What do we have next? Where's there was another quest? Huh. 
This is why we have Death Eaters, man. <laughs> I wish you could. They should have literally made it like some like GTA type stuff where I could kill students just for no reason. Like I could just walk this way and smack them with a spell and then just end them. And then they can chase me down and try to attack me. I thought I think that'd be kind of cool. That'd be a nice little update. I'm not gonna like the school at nighttime. They'd be hearing all kind of things in the hallways. Silas. That's literally kind of what this school is like. I don't know how in world any of these kids can focus when there's so much shit going on. You got ghosts chasing after each other, coming out of the toilet, the paintings talking, riddles just everywhere. I mean, to it's me, very it sounds like the, the people running the school are just not like, organizing the school to be an environment you can pay attention to <laughs> in class. That's fair. Oh, there she goes. Honora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I'm afraid I can't tell you, Lenora. Surely you jest. <laughs> you should have worked it out on your own. You have nerve. Especially since I'm the one who told you about it in the first place. Imagine solving a riddle that i mentioned and then not telling me the answer practically competing with an artist who is the more infuriating know it all that's crazy step your game up next time they said that he has the most phenomenal rbf <laughs> <laughs> do i have to be a jerk in order to go down the dark path or is it just like I don't think so because they said you learned like, unforgiving spells later on. But I have to find those though. Oh, so no, I don't have to be. No, I yeah, don't have to be no. petty. I can just be a jerk. No, you're just an asshole. <laughs> no, I did not get anything from her. Because you probably chose not to tell her. So that's probably why you didn't get a prize from her. No, you don't have to. Interesting. Oh, it's a main quest choice. Oh, whoops. Oh, dear. I shall get in trouble. Is everything all right? Oh, hello. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way. And I'm afraid everything's not all right. I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation, because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. That sounds brilliant, actually. Thank you. Somehow, I don't think the librarian will see it that way. I collect the books and remove the charm myself. Except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened Roshi the people of the library. In school so he can kill his Our meet told <laughs> Madam Scribner they were my books flying around. So she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Perhaps you could get them for me. There are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student looking around. Why did Army tell Madame Scribner that they were your books? Oh, to be perfectly honest, I don't think he meant any harm. I think he was impressed, bragging on my behalf. Amit spends a lot of time gazing at the stars, but he knows a good charm when he sees one. <laughs> I suppose I could help, if I have the time. Oh, I'd very much appreciate it. One of the books is my diary. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong okay, hands. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'll read it. If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. Bet. I'll so make sure to read it. So these characters look 50 and 16 at the same time. <laughs> 50 and 16 at the same time. That's kind of accurate, actually. All right. Um... You're about to find her diary and read about her tweezing her butt hairs. <laughs> That's what you want to read. 
Is that the kind of stuff you used to write in your diary? Absolutely about not. About tweezing your butt hair? So then what kind of statement was that? I don't know what she writes about. Where's the clock tower at? Where the... the Cause somebody said that there was an I could go back and do it by myself. The combat. Somebody said they used to write how many times they farted that day in their diary. Oh, there is no combat going on right now. Yeah. You know what? Get one handles as a reward and gold. Janiqua, I ain't exposed mm. Jack. Let's do this quest. Secret secrets are no fun. Not fresh, bro. Take that off. Somebody said the best way to keep your secrets is kill everyone and then yourself, and then nobody knows your secrets. Or you could just, you know, not tell anybody and then clock yourself, and then no one will ever know your secrets. Oh, All right. I'm going to have to use Akio to get those book. Got it. Only four more to go. But I don't know who this game thought they were dealing with. I am the Akio Master. Akio! This must be Cressida's diary. Ah, we get to I'd read want it. I'd this back too if I were her. Today was a good day. That is, until Garrus splashed whatever ridiculous concoction he was creating all of my perfectly stewed lace wing, lace wing files. I was about to say lace front. Had to empty my entire cauldron and start all over again. He is such a menace. Thinks he knows everything there is to know about potions. Always disrupting Professor Sharp's class with his experiments. I'm utterly convinced that he wasn't. If he wasn't Professor Weasley's nephew, he would have been expelled by now. Arboroth. Smokies again for tonight for dinner. I'm becoming more partial to them now. Although I still prefer meat pie. Mm, that's what I say. It sounds like some kind of meatloaf. Where are these books at, bro? That was two of them, right? Oh, oh. Akio! Three of them. I've 
See if I see any of them flying about. You heard that? Where'd it go? Okay, we have one more. One more. Yoink. That's the last book. Now to take them back to Cressida. Rebellion. One of the first librarians of Hogwarts is depicted here. Rumor is that he had no tolerance whatsoever for noisy students and was known for his liberal use of the silencing charm at the slightest sneeze. It's lit, bro. Fuck them kids. Shut the fuck up. That's right. I'm with it. Completely silence these children. She's still here. He says when he has two kids. Listen, if I had the silencing charm, I'd use it. Shh. My little brother sends me letters. I would also use it on the chat. Shh. Any luck finding my diary and the rest of my book? Hello, Cressida. I collected your books, including your diary. Oh, what a relief. Thank you. I'll happily take the heavy lot off your hands now. All right, sure. What should we do? Should we blackmail her? Perhaps a reward to keep the diary a secret. Just give it to me. What? You want me to just be nice? I mean, there's too much energy. How's chat feeling about this? You just choose. Yeah, one EM. For Wait, page. can I do? Can I do I'm a collab? Listen, somebody just said, can I do a collab with the tipsy bartender? He's the homie. He's not literally your homie, you liar. Whoever said that. His videos are actually funny. I would drink one of his concoctions and I'd probably die. Here you are. Well, lesson learned. I certainly won't be practicing any charms in the library again anytime soon. Now, to work out where I went wrong. Perhaps One yam I should per start page. brushing up on my Latin. On the police. Thank goodness some people are trustworthy. Certainly wouldn't want anyone but me reading my diary. All right, we level five already. I Only missed out on that from the other chick for being rude. Miss out on what? Whatever reward she probably would have. She probably didn't give you anything. Somebody said she gave you something. Imagine solving what the hell a riddle was that? that I mentioned and then not telling me the answer. You still shut up. You still going on about that? To see who's a more infuriating know it all. They said she did. She didn't give me. She would have given you something, yes. Is there something floating around here? You hear it? Bro, I'm about to lose my mind. What is that? How do I get up there? Okay, discovery music just starts playing and then I don't know what's going on, so I'm leaving. Let's go back and wrap up for the day.
Thank you for Thank Donald Seraph. Give you back bet. the die with no pain. That's Hufflepuff behavior. Actually, you know what? You're right. They said it was just blackmail. They didn't say what we're gonna blackmail her with. <clears throat> what about the room, Professor? Deke? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. The slave shit. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. Deke nuts. I trust your first classes went well? Freaky Deke. They did, Professor. <laughs> I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details, mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streamer. <gasps> Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. What does that mean? In that regard, I've asked your professors to help you? hasten your progress with some extra assignments. <laughs> <laughs> Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. There's an Ollivander's in Hogsmeade. There is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. Mr. Ollivander is a genuine craftsman and highly skilled wand maker. I would trust no one else to pair me with a wand. Hmm. I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. Thanks for the sub, Samurai. Can you tell me more about the potions shop, Professor? J. Pippin's Potions stocks a wide array of potions ingredients, although they rarely sell recipes. Mm -hmm. Professor this, Sharp oh, asked that they have a couple of particular recipes on hand for you. I can't. I can't Bean, Venus Flickerous. Bro, I need you gotta to get stop. to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows Venus the area. Greenest. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow. Jack you Harlow. Can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Listen. I didn't want to go with Sebastian because he left me high and dry in that fight. And I'm not rocking with that. I'm not jacking that. You hear me? You heard? I'm not jacking that. You heard? What they say? All right, they're just bust this nutus, bro. <laughs> Speak to Professor Ronan to receive your first assignment. Assignments or types of quests given to you by Hogwarts professors that when completed reward you with new spells. The reward for completing your first assignment will be the Mending Charm Reparo, which is required to complete other quests. See, so now we're going to be on the same level as the professor. Like, when he was like, Reparo, and he built the whole bridge, and you're like, oh, you didn't see that he did that? I did say he did that, and I hope that I get to take him out at some point. 
Like, what's up? What's up, cuz? Okay. <laughs> Metus Beatus. <laughs> I can't with these comments. Metus Beatus. <laughs> They're like a. And what you call the the thing in there? The, the name the thing named Deke. It's a Deke here down. <laughs> the house elf. The racist. The the slave shit. Yeah. The slave elf. That's how it started, and then it evolved from the elves. <laughs> Wow, so this game has not been saving this entire time? That's crazy. What, what would have happened if like my PS5 would just shut off? I would have lost all of that. Yep. Okay, no, there is auto save because that says manual save. Okay. All right. That is a good stopping point for tonight. We got a lot accomplished, man. We did a lot. The did some side quests. Yes. We did some side quests. Got sorted into the house, the exact house that I wanted, Slytherin. Um, I was a jerk for a lot of the stream because I thought that my choices would lead me down that path. But apparently you guys are telling me that I don't have to be a complete asshole to everybody that I talk to. So maybe I shouldn't block my blessings with some of these characters and try and be nice. You know, it might work out in my favor. I'm not sure because I was having fun being a jerk. Like I didn't care that that girl was mad that I didn't tell her like, Figure it out on your own. You know what I'm saying? I did the work. Just like how I did the work with the key. And now the professor got the key. So when the game is done, I'm going to take it back from him by force. Still embarrassed for you that that I lost to who? Not side? She cheated, bro. She did not cheat. She cheated. We still on the road to learn the forbidden spell. Yes. That's exactly what I want. Um, I'm having a lot of fun. The game is very rich with things to do the world is rich there's a lot going on in the school at one time it's a lot to take in i'm not even gonna lie like you easily so far i noticed that i can easily get distracted by different things in the area like i'm running around and i'm like oh what's that and there'll be a random puzzle somewhere or like a page floating around or like that the ghost peeves that came out of the toilet with the shit water like nice. there's a lot happening that can distract you from your main quest which i yes. like so and it makes you eager to do other things in the game so it doesn't feel dry or anything like at, at this point i don't know if any of these quests are going to be repetitive like if there's going to be another character that's like oh man i somehow cast that same spell on my books can you go get those five books for me over there in the gymnasium like i don't know if it's going to be like that kind of like an assassin's creed thing all. where there's always like a you always gotta tail somebody like I, i'm not sure but we'll see and grandma's body be distracting too. What? Somebody said, how do you look old and young at the same time? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> so easy character. Okay, yo, W stream. We had a lot of fun. We're going to continue on our journey playing this game. Uh, we're not going to just, we're not going to drop it because I'm enjoying this. It's a lot of fun and I want to see what it's like when I become a death eater. So yeah. And clearly a lot of people see it. Yes. A lot of you joined us. Yes, tonight. a lot of you jumped in tonight, so Thank we appreciate you. it. But yo, that is going to be it for tonight's stream for Hogwarts Legacy. Thank you for joining us. We hope you have a great night, and we will catch you guys for the next one. Uh, have a great night. Enjoy. Peace.